Hey art friends, we're so glad you're with us. Valentine's is coming up, right? Yeah. Yeah, so we're gonna draw a heart with wings. Mm -hmm. Okay, checkers, you got your marker? We hope you guys are gonna follow along with us. If we go too fast, they can do what? Pause the video. Yeah, you guys can always pause the video. All right, you ready to start? Yeah. All right, checkers, this is gonna be super fun and it's gonna be a lot like a doodle. Do you know what doodling is? Yay. It's kind of when you got <laughs> when you get a design and you just kind of fill the whole paper with it. Oh. So this is a really fun uh, exercise in doodling. So we're gonna draw a heart right in the middle, okay? And we don't want it too big because we're gonna use most of the space for the wings. So we're gonna draw heart, and we can practice this, huh? Hearts are really simple practice. to draw, but sometimes. They seem very difficult because they're so simple. So at the bottom of my heart, I'm going to kind of curl it out just a little like this. There we go. <laughs> and I'm going to come around and actually thicken these lines up just a little more. Good job, checkers! You did awesome on your heart. Okay, now we're gonna we're gonna do the wings, and yeah. this is where it's gonna get really fun. So we're gonna start up here, and we're gonna just draw a little S line that comes out of the middle of the heart. So we can either do one wing first, and then come over and do the other wing, or we could do the wings together and draw them very symmetrical. So it doesn't matter. I let's do this other part of the wing right here on this side. But we'll finish, let's finish one wing first, and then we'll come over to the other wing. Good job. Okay, so now let's curl back around like this for the first feather. Then we're going to draw the next part of the wing, which is going to come out like this. Up, and then curl like that. Okay, now we're going to come back down here, and we're going to finish the inside of the first wing. So we're going to draw a bunch of loops or use that are connected together. And I'm going to start fanning them down like this towards the bottom of the heart. Awesome. Okay, let's stop there. We're gonna come back over here and we're gonna curl this like that. And we can curl the other side too. This is going to help us with the inside feathers. Good. Okay, now let's come back and we'll do another feather that comes up. Like that. And then we'll keep going and fill the rest of the feathers in till they match with the feathers that we had already drawn up here. Good job. Went up. That's okay. You can keep going and keep going and until they connect. Good job. Good job. That's all right. <laughs> keep going. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Good job, man. That looks really cool. I like these feathers. They look like hot dogs. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you know what? Let's come back over and we'll build. We'll start building the other wing too. So let's do this first feather that, like we did over here, and then we're gonna build those other U's, just the same. And we can kind of look at the other side while we're doing this, so that it looks similar. I'm going to come back down here and do these other feathers down here. <laughs> awesome! I love it! Okay, now let's draw some more little feathers inside.
Good, that looks awesome, man. Okay, now we're gonna come out here and we're gonna draw the longer feathers up here on this wing. So this one's gonna be a really big feather. We're gonna come back like that. Then we're gonna draw another really big feather that comes out and does the same thing right next to it. Now we're gonna draw more feathers, but we're gonna fan them down. So they're gonna come down like this and they're gonna get smaller and smaller. So this shape is gonna come in like this. Okay? Okay. All right, let's fast forward right, right now. Good job, keep going. Do one more. Oh, uh, that's really cool. Okay, now we're gonna do the same thing on this side. Okay, okay. let's okay. fast forward again. Oh, that looks really cool. Now we've got all these little spaces in between our feathers. So let's do another row of feathers in between those. So one, we can draw a line that comes out and then comes back in and see how we put a feather in between those. Yeah. But this row looks like it's behind the first row that we drew. So now we're gonna go through and fill in all of those spaces with another row of feathers. Okay, we got all of the feathers in there. Now we're gonna add a little extra shading to our feathers so it looks more 3D. Okay. So we're gonna start with this inside row right here and we're gonna draw a spike in the middle. And because we're using a Sharpie, it's kinda of easy to fill in that spike. So I'm gonna come in here and draw a spike in each of the center centers of each of the, the feathers. Okay? Okay. All right, we got the shading in on that row of feathers. Now let's come up here and we're gonna do another row of shading. So this one's gonna be even longer. We're gonna come out like this and then back in. So we got that big long spike and we're gonna do that on the inside ones too. So on the next row, see how that adds a little bit of shading? Yeah. And we're using our marker so it looks even cooler because it's nice and black. Okay, now we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Okay. All right. Awesome job, man. It looks super 3D, yeah. even just with our markers. Mm -hmm. But let's get our colored pencils and we're gonna do even more shading. Okay. We got our colors picked out. We're gonna keep it nice and simple. We got white, red, and black. black. And our art friends can use anything, but we're gonna show, uh, show you guys how to use colored pencils and do some blending with these. All right, so let's first start with red and we're gonna put a nice light layer of red over our heart. Now we're gonna add some shading and some highlighting. So we're gonna first use our black and just at the bottom of our heart, we're gonna do a nice light layer at the bottom. And I'm doing it so that there's kind of a curve right here. But I'm not putting a hard line down, just a nice, light layer of black over the bottom half of our heart. Okay, and then the top part of our heart, I'm gonna put, uh, I'm gonna blend with the white just on this bump and the other bump. And I'm pressing pretty hard so that it's blended. Now we're gonna get our red again and we're gonna go back over the whole thing, but we're gonna press really hard. And I'm gonna press, I'm going to press really hard, but I'm not gonna go over the highlighted part. So the part where we went over with white. Good job. Now I'm gonna add a little extra shading with the black, just right down on the bottom edge of the heart. Good job, checkers. Okay, we're done with our heart. Now we're gonna we're gonna get our black, and we're gonna shade uh, the uh, what are these things called? Wings. Feathers. Feathers. <laughs> I couldn't think of it. All right, so we're gonna come up here, and let's start on this big one. So I'm gonna show you 
We're going to start on a dark right here against uh, the other row. And then as we come out to the outside of the feather, we're going to get lighter and lighter and lighter until you can't even see the marks anymore. And then we're going to do that below the center of that feather too. So we'll start really dark right here and get lighter and lighter. Do you remember what this, does this remind you of a different art project we did uh, with wings? It also had wings. No. The Phoenix. Oh. <laughs> okay. So we're going to do that on each feather all the way down. Okay. Okay. All right. Let's fast forward right, right now. now. Good job, man. We got them all shaded. Okay, now we're going to blend with the white. So we okay. come back with the white and we can go back over it and blend it over into the white. Completely smooth out all of those pencil marks. That look cool. Chuckers, man, I like it. And I like the little extra shading you put around the heart. Did you have a lot of fun? Yeah. It turned out amazing. Mm -hmm. This is a really cool Valentine's drawing, don't you think? Yeah. Give it five. We hope you guys had a lot of fun drawing your hearts with us. Remember, it's okay that your drawings look different than ours. I hope they do. And you can even fill your paper even with more feathers. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. That would look awesome if we just kept going. <laughs> we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Bye,